بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله على سيدنا محمد وعلى اله وصحبه وسلم الحمد لله uh, the greensville trust we're holding an arabic week in bradford and also in liverpool inshallah in which we pray that people are given the experience and an exposure to the beautiful language of arabic that language which allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has mentioned in the quran when we think about languages each one has its peculiarity its particular blessing that it brings and so when we think about arabic it can we immediately think about the quran we think about the prophet muhammad peace be upon him and it's interconnected and allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tells us that he revealed the quran in arabic and the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam spoke in arabic and when we look at the salaf the likes of the four imams uh, that they disliked any change within the religion in fact they considered arabic from the religion Imam Malik said that anybody who speaks other than Arabic should leave this masjid, meaning the masjid of the Prophet ﷺ. This was their covetousness and their protection over the Arabic language. And in it is the preservation of this religion. And in it is the preservation of a person's connection with Allah and the Prophet ﷺ. When you read the Quran in Arabic or you understand the words of the Prophet ﷺ in Arabic, it has a different impact that cannot be replicated through translation. And so we encourage everybody to attend the Arabic week to get a taste of this beautiful language and may it be the beginning of a beautiful journey to arriving at an understanding of some of the Quran and the Prophet ﷺ through a very unique three-year course that is run, which is immersive, which contains an ability to speak and write and read. And we have students who have gone from no understanding of Arabic whatsoever to be able to have a conversation within Arabic and to write in Arabic and to understand Arabic. So we pray that Allah opens the doors for you to go and embark on this journey of learning Arabic. Ameen. Wa sallallahu ala Sayyidina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.